Welcome back to Group A practice in Kansas. William Byron, fastest over Noah Gregson and Denny Hamlin, Chevy Ford Toyota in that order. Uh, Corey Heim back in the 43 this week for Legacy Motor Club. Interesting set of circumstances here in that Eric Jones has been approved by the doctors to resume racing. However, and they use the worn out phrase, out of an abundance of caution, there is Eric Jones uh, up on the hauler looking on. Uh, he's going to sit out one more week, allow that uh, fractured vertebrae to heal further, get back in the car in Darlington. I, I can only guess how hard that must be for him to wait another week, but sounds like a good move to me. Well, at this point, you've missed a week. Why not just take two out of out of, out of caution and, and make sure you're ready? Obviously, we for us... We're talking about a vertebrae. Yeah, like, we, we're not talking about a pinky. Yeah, but we all know that he is really good at Darlington. We know that Eric Jones is going to be able to, to have a, a good weekend and just needs to be physically 100% ready for, for that race. So Corey Heim ended up uh, 25th last week at Dover in his cup debut, but uh, but had a good race. I thought he did a fantastic job. As we see Austin Hill coming to pit road, definitely something you need to do before you get to the end of this practice. You see how hard those cars uh, come off the apron uh, with that transition from the banking. But uh, definitely you got to have a good marker. However you use it, there's hash marks on the inside, on the apron. There's signs on the wall. There's billboards on the outside of the corner. So you just you pick up uh, one of those markers so you have a visual during your green flag stops for the weekend. He had a short day in Texas in his cup debut, but he's a former truck winner here. He'll have uh, two RCR teammates, Kyle Busch, of course, and Austin Dillon. Yeah, and you see Austin Dillon, everybody's migrated to this top line right here, coming off of, off of uh, turn four. Uh, Austin rode above that seam all the way in as we go into turn one here. Everybody will still be in that, that top groove. There's a bump right at the beginning of this corner, right about where that sign is, that you got to make sure your car is straight and you start to either have that spike of the throttle through the center of the corner or you go back to partial throttle. Uh, but lots of momentum, and you got to be able to be good uh, from the driver's compartment and, and be in a good rhythm by the end of this practice because I would say, Clint, that you might qualify up there and you're going to run pretty much the whole race up there, so you need to pre be pretty comfortable up there at what you're doing. So practice ends for Group A.